what we do is traditionally we have a product that's a self-contained camera system where what you probably have right now most people have is one that has a lot of infrastructure in it you build a server yeah you have to run the infrastructure from that those cameras to the server uh, which costs a lot of money so what we've done is uh, 15 years ago we designed this product and we call it a pod and it has three pan tilt zoom cameras one stationary camera has a two terabyte hard drive on board so you're recording on board and what you're going to do if you have a problem area all you need to do is this all comes with it we give you a mounting bracket and a bandit you banded this to the pole most times people are going to put it on a street light on a street light pole may, probably owned by the city um, has a photo cell on top of the of the of the light which controls the day and night when it turns on off and on so what we can do is we can take our photo cell adapter here and take the photo cell off on the top of the pole put this in its place put the original photo cell back here and what it does is it all works the same but it adds 110 power or 220 power to this plug you plug this in the back of the unit within two minutes you're watching video just that simple so i'm going to show you how the pan tilt zoom works uh there's a sign down at this location if i want to see that i can go over and i preset that at preset 10. i hit preset 10 i hit move and i'm going to be down there and being able to view that sign at that down there at that location now i can take that and if i pull that back slowly you'll see how far that is away from the camera so we're going all this direction here and you can't even get an idea there's a sign down there but let's say i want to see a license plate i have a preset 11 where there's usually a vehicle i can hit preset 11. it's going to zoom in on this car's license plate so i can get 327713l and i'm going to zoom that back to show you how far that is away so as we pull back so that gives you an idea there now if i give you to the preset 12 uh, we have quite a few drug task force that use this that's going to go back to preset 13 and we have quite a few um, drug task force that use this. So uh, imagine this is the house that there's a, there's a drug house and they want to see us coming in and out of the house. We can zoom in from there, but the camera is actually quite a long ways away and they have no idea that they're filming them at, at the house. The most important thing is a lot of cameras, first we cover the expense of the infrastructure. The second big expense is the ongoing operation of it. Most camera companies, I would probably say 99% of the camera companies out there, they're going to charge you, even though you purchase the cameras, they're going to charge you a yearly fee for the cameras. So you're going to see a bill of $125 to $175 a year per camera every year as long as you have their cameras. We do not charge you another dime. When we get updated from our manufacturer, we send it to you for free or we give it to you for free or we download it or we, or we can service you for free on that. 99% of our, our pods, we, use, we furnish it with a cellular modem in the unit. And all you're going to do is send us a SIM card. So we're going to pre-program the, the unit. So when you get it, it's going to be plug it in and it's ready to go using the cellular network. What that does, it makes it completely portable. Take it down, move it to another location. Uh, within 30 minutes, 40 minutes, you can have it from one location to another location. And uh, what we find is when cameras go up, usually the problems solve themselves. It, they, it stops. Well, when you put that infrastructure in, into a camera, and you, all of a sudden you have a camera up there that's stuck there. You can have a camera that you don't even use because that area stopped the problem. Well, with our camera, you take it down and move it to an area that you have a problem in. So uh, down the road, uh, there is, there's really a lot of difference between our cameras and theirs. And uh, we can service them. Uh, what's nice too is when something happens with the pod, let's say a camera goes out, you're just going to pay for a camera. You're not going to pay for the whole new thing. Uh, we also give you free software to uh, to go on your phone. So I'm I'm viewing the cameras live on my phone. I can go in here and I can tap on it and I can even zoom in on my phone to be able to see a closer picture on my phone. If you're a police officer, you can have it on your, your car monitor so you can pull it right up there. You know, we have instances where uh, I know in uh, Tascadero, California, they had a fight at the movie theater. There was a, uh, somebody called dispatch, dispatch somebody. Well, on the way, uh, the guy went and hid. Police got there. The guy wasn't there. Dispatch said he's behind the blue garbage can. She sat there and watched him on the on the monitor on the on the uh, cameras hide behind the garbage cans. The officers walked over behind this big guard dumpster and he was hiding behind there. So it's things like that. It's very effective. Very effective. To get more information, go to www.securitylines.us.